you get food delivered all the time. Heck, you can even get booze delivered if you have the right app. But starting today, your delivery driver can bring you something else. Weed delivered right to your door. Fun fact about this burger and that cake and this pizza, they'll all get you high. And now you got your Uber Eats, you got your Uber to pick you up, you got your DoorDash. They can all be delivered to you. We expect to be up probably in a couple of weeks and going strong by December 1st. Recreational marijuana home delivery became legal as of Friday. Order this or this or this and someone will drive it right to you, like pizza delivery. Mint Cannabis says it'll be popular, but it may not increase business. I think the customer base in Arizona has pretty much set settled. Uh, so it'll probably increase a little bit, but it, overall it'll be a switch from people who are coming into the store who are now receiving it at home. There are some rules. To deliver, you have to have a safe in the delivery car, a security plan, and you can only deliver to the person who ordered and make sure that person's of legal age. Definitely our biggest thing on Friday is going to be ensuring first that we're, um, you know, serving people of age. You know, that's going to be a big thing for us. So we will have uh, card swipers in the cars. All Greens Dispensary in Sun City has a fleet ready to go. They've had it for years because their primary customers are medical marijuana patients. Medical marijuana requires a card and is a little more potent. I think this will help ease a lot of people into now getting a delivery um, and now being able to, uh, you know, try cannabis for the first time if they never have. All Green sells recreationally too, but industry experts say this is mostly about convenience, not increasing business. People who want to use cannabis know where to get cannabis, and this is just making it more convenient for patients, for consumers, for people who use it for their own reasons. Dispensary owners say they thought this was coming in January. They were surprised it went into effect Friday. Now when they flip the switch and start delivery, they know it'll be a huge shift in the Arizona marijuana business. This is going to be very popular. There's a big section of the uh, consumers out there that do not want to commit to the dispensary. William Pitts, 12 News.